Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sav if you're new and today we are continuing our legacy challenge, of course. So today we are aging up Edison and aging up Sarah. In the last one, we got engaged and moved Stacy into the house. I, uh, this wig sheds so much. It's one of my cheaper ones. It's not natural looking at all, but I really, really like the color and I haven't worn it in forever. I always get questions about my wigs too and I, I just get them all on Amazon. Some of them really good quality and some of them are not. They're just for fun, so. <laughs> all right guys, I hope you all are doing well. Thank you so much for being here. Let's get into it. So I spent a little bit of time this morning organizing the <clears throat> collections, the legacy house is what I call it. Um, even though the whole lot is like the legacy lot, I like to call this the legacy house. <laughs> uh, we have all of our collections here from metals, we got the microscope prints, we got the potions, we got the crystals. Um, I worked on mounting more fish, frogs, aliens, fossils, seashells, space rocks, snow globes, eggs, simmies, um, these holiday cracker plushy things. Um, underwater prints, one of you guys said that that was a collection so we can work on that too. These are um, the birth certificates from the generation where we had to have 10 kids. These are our paintings for every mood. We are missing the angry painting. We've got flirty, confident, sad, focused, playful, and then we need angry elements. We got some a space rock over here. Over here we have our experimental food pictures. Still need a couple more of those. Our um, My Sims trophies, yes. And then these are all of our <laughs> artifacts or ancient artifacts so Ren is down here working on that and then we're getting close to 10 million so I guess we can put some more in here add money to vault and to the amount um let's do six million hello are you good oh okay she's going now I want to see if the vault <laughs> the look of the vault changes once we add more Nope, nothing changed. Look at all these gold bars and bills though. Close and lock, play with money. What does that look like? <laughs> I feel like this is what she does at work. Oh my God. <laughs> that maniacal laughter, oh yeah? <laughs> Who are you talking to? <laughs> All right, close and lock. Okay. Um, what is Sarah doing? Sarah, you stink <clears throat> really, really badly. Okay. Well, let's go ahead. Let's take a bath. Let's make sure everyone's in a good mood for the birthday party tonight or the dinner. Aww. Oh yeah, I gave Stacy um, a couple new outfits, <clears throat> and um, I gave her like a nice updo. Um, I left most of her outfits the same because I I haven't read a comment yet from the creator of her, but um, yeah, I gave her a little bit of blush, and I just think she looks really nice with with her hair up. So look at her, she she gives me like, she definitely gives me housewife vibes from her traits. She's romantic, cheerful, and family oriented. I don't know, I just get domestic vibes from her. So <laughs> yeah, um, and then Edison, um, a lot of you guys were like down to have, you need to take a shower too, down to have um, Eloise move in as well after their birthday. So I was kind of thinking we could like ha make like make this guest house theirs. Him and Eloise can live out their days in here. I want to get them some like rocking chairs and yeah, I just want them to have like just a cute a cute elder time. Whoa. When it's locked, look, all the lasers. <laughs> That's so funny. I love that. I also think that we need more plasma packs for Ren. Um, yes, let me go upstairs and do that really quick. Oh, Edison should totally buy a sweetheart's box for Eloise. Go streaking! 
Why? Why is everyone in my game streaking right now? Is that like the new glitch? Is it the new thing? It's really annoying. <laughs> um, Listen to space launch? What? Edison, please go back inside. Hey, look, someone made an Eiffel Tower. Well, that's adorable. Listen to space launch. That is so funny. The Finchwick Fair has started. What does this even do, I wonder? No way. <laughs> Purchase Sweetheart's box. Candied figs. <gasps> Mochi, donut drops, chocolate truffles, chocolate strawberries, pan dulce, popcorn clusters, or profiteroles. Guys, that's so cute. I think we should get chocolate strawberries. That's adorable. I do want to give that to Eloise tonight. And then Sarah, hmm, what should we give our dad? Can I give them your number? Sure. Um, how's your painting skill? I don't even think she has any painting skill. We could... Let's see. We could take <clears throat> a really, like, nice planned picture of the rocket. Because Edison is just, like, really into rockets right now. Yeah, what if we took a picture of it and framed it and then gave that to him for his birthday to hang in the guest house when they move? Okay, and then what if we put like... I like the warm filter a lot. That's kind of cute. The rockets on the treehouse with the ro with the actual rocket. <laughs> okay, all of these two are outstanding. These two are normal. I'm gonna sell the normal ones. And then I think I think I like this one the best. So let's sell that. Let's. <clears throat> Out of frame. Let's do. Let's do black. And then we'll name it. Do dad love Sarah. <laughs> sure. Okay. All right. So that's her gift to him. And then his gift to her. That's kind of hard. He gave her a bike for her birthday one year, he gave her a horse. For her birthday after that how do you top a horse i don't know guys i have no idea um hold on let me look at her skills really quick maybe some jewelry ren has a ton of jewelry in her inventory <laughs> this bracelet that would be that'd be a nice gift just like a little bracelet it has nothing it has no uh like abilities but yeah i think she would she would like it anyways Oh my god, is that a cheese? Oh, that's so cute. Large hoop cheese. I love that. All right. Um, so let's go ahead and travel to a restaurant for our birthday. Let's try this one. Giardino Fresco. Should we bring Teddy? <laughs> I don't know if there's going to be a big enough table if we start inviting a bunch of people. All righty, here we are. Look at how beautiful this freaking restaurant is. Oh my god, I can't get over it. Uh, I hope that there's a table big enough. Oh, there's like a whole ass house up here. A bed and everything. Wow. It's so beautiful and so romantic. Someone already snagged this table. Oh, nope, just kidding. Request table. Hurry, quickly, go, go, go. Everyone's in their formal wear. I love it. How fancy. And Sarah, why are you cross-stitching? <laughs> And Ren is knitting. Guys, please. They did not want to be bored tonight, so they brought activities. Yay! What a nice dinner. I'm actually shook at how nice this is. Oh, look at it. She's a pregnant. <laughs> so cute. I wonder if she's still having a boy. Because that was before my game crashed. No, it's a girl now. Oh my god. Okay. Wow, it's beautiful in here. Holy crap. I'm shook. Welcome everybody. Yes, yes, sit, sit. It's giving rich. It is. 
Who are we missing? Did I count wrong? Oh no, Stacy. Where's Stacy at? Sit down, girl. There we go. All right. Gang's all here. This is so cute, guys. <laughs> all right. Oh my gosh. I don't think I've ever been to a restaurant with this many sims like on one table <clears throat> um i'm gonna go okay so let's see with edison should i just get them all oh i'm gonna get him an old-fashioned i'm gonna get a cosmo for eloise and evangeline i'm gonna get apple teeny for stacy and then Oh my god, absinthe? Absinthe for Ren. Mmm. Wine for Sarah and Jamie. Okay, everyone's got a drink. And now. Ooh, it's an experimental food. Some of it at least. Sizzled brisket over sour clover salad for Edison. Salmon for Eloise. Evangeline's pregnant, so I don't know if she would want anything weird. I'm gonna get her. Steak, tiger, shrimp, let's see, trout, mire, oh my god. Um, Stacy can have that. Volcano pasta for Jamie. Jungle moss egg with lavender wisps for Sarah. <laughs> and then we're just missing food for Ren, but she she doesn't eat, so that's okay. Maybe I should get her something so she can take a picture of it. This, I don't think we have. Okay, $401. I love how Sarah's cross-stitching at the table. It's honestly hilarious. Huh? Stacy has learned Sarah's romantic boundaries. Non-physical romance will trigger jealousy. Physical romance and woohoo. Okay, you guys are talking about that right now? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Is Stacy flirting with someone else? Ouch, Stacy and Sarah seem to have hit a rough patch in their romance. Romantic partners with a strained romance dynamic will gravitate towards mean socials more often. As a result of tension they're currently facing, luckily they'll still be able to work on their dynamic to fix things when the time comes. Okay, who are you flirting with though is the real question. Be greeted. By who? Jamie? Yo, why why does everyone love Stacy? Jamie, you better not. You better not. Oh my god. They have romance. Sarah saw Stacy break romantic boundaries and is thinking of breaking up. Evangeline, how are you not pissed? Give cold shoulder. I'm so mad, guys. Jamie, really? Jamie agree gave her a romantic introduction, and that's what triggered all of this. Wow. Look at all of it. It looks so good. I don't know what to do, guys. That was pretty messed up, wasn't it? <gasps> Evangeline was just talking about Stacy. Oh my god, I need to know what's going on between them right now. Oh yeah. Ew. <laughs> Stacy, you are making a bad impression. Very bad. This is the first family dinner we're having and you are not singing. She's singing! Okay. Okay, and now Jamie and Evangeline are flirting again. I'm confused. I'm keeping an eye on everyone. 
Oh god, there goes Jamie, dude. Alright, make a wish. Family oriented, loyal, and self assured. That's pretty good. Hapleborfna! Okay, let me find a good. A good area for a screenshot here. Wow. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh my god. Elder Edison! Happy birthday! Oh, Evangeline should be aging up as well. Oh my gosh. Oh, sorry, sir. That was a little, a little invasive, wasn't it? Oh man, look at him. Look at him. <laughs> Seniority! Seniority indeed. I hope someone didn't make a, or take a slice. I wonder if Evangeline's gonna age up. Oh, she can't, she's pregnant. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Oh gosh. Okay, my turn. It is your birthday, right? Let me just double check. Yeah, one. All right, we can do it early. Okay, happy birthday, babes. Sorry that, sorry that your girl is flirting with your freaking aunt's husband. <laughs> Messy. Blow out the candle. Stop yapping. I'm just having such a good time observing. <laughs> All right. Actually, blow out the candles this time. Thank you. Happy birthday, beautiful. Adulthood. Who are you guys? Why are you in this room with us? <laughs> Ren's like, oh, you want to have a, a sing-off? Bet. <sighs> okay, so I'm thinking about it, right? She didn't really do anything. Jamie is the one that gave her a flirty romantic introduction. The only thing that she did bad was take it. Um, instead of being like, what? No, don't, don't, don't be romantic with me right now. You know, I just don't know. I don't know. It is pretty messed up though. I'm not going to lie. They have a bunch of romance. Oh, we should also age up Eloise here. I don't know how much longer she's got. 39 out of 42. Yeah, we might as well just do it now. Why is everyone singing? It's weird, right? All right. Happy birthday to you as well, Miss Miss Eloise. So Edison, do you want to go ask her to join to join our household? Would that make you happy? Whoa. Sergio, you're scaring me. Who's these? Ashley Ambrose. Newt Tail. What is happening here? Who are you meowing at? She's serenading Sarah right now. Kick soccer ball with us. She's like, I'm gonna go do this with my dad. You can sing to yourself. <laughs> Not in the hallway, right in the middle. Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. oh no. What are you guys doing in here? I mean, she's really good at singing for someone who doesn't have any singing skill. Wait, what? How does she have skills now? I am so confused. You guys saw it yesterday. It said she had no skills, but now she's got a bunch. I'm so confused right now. Wait, be a parent to a child with three friends? You don't have any kids. Okay. 
Okay, I see what's going on here. This was a sim that you guys uploaded and you probably did this in your game and uploaded it, uploaded her with all of this stuff already here. I mean, that's fine. I like that she's got some skills and stuff already. She's pretty OP. I mean, I'm not gonna count. I'm not gonna count any of it for legacy though. Maybe I should just reset her, reset her skills so I can keep track and stuff. We probably should do that. Forget all skills. Yeah, she's an adult with no skills, but it's, it's okay. It's okay. That's uh, basically how we'd get her if she was a random townie anyways. Also, one of you guys said that it's against the rules to take money from a spouse that you bring into the house. I don't, know, I don't know if that's a thing or not, but even if it is, it doesn't even matter. We have like a stupid amount of money that it doesn't, <laughs> it's not gonna do anything anymore. <laughs> Um, but anyway, let's get Eloise, or let's give Eloise the gift, um, the sweetheart box that we got her. And then let's give Sarah her, her bracelet as well. I can understand, like, taking money in the beginning from a spouse when you're, like, kind of broke. I get why that, that would be against the rules, but really doesn't matter anymore. Stacy has learned that J- Oh my god, she's over there blowing him kisses, guys! I cannot believe this is happening right now. Where is poor Evangeline? Did she leave? She's not even here. And she's having a baby. She's having his baby, you guys. Wow, this is... I did not expect this to happen. Oh, Sarah's pissed. Sarah... Sarah saw Stacy break her romantic boundary. She will break up with Stacy if it happens one more time. Autonomously? I really want to see him give her this box, but I also, like, want to watch them over there, too. Oh, what's this? Oh! Why is he eating them? <gasps> ah! It happened again! Sarah saw Stacy break her romantic boundaries and decided to break up. Sarah and Stacy are no longer partners. Stacy just broke off their engagement with Sarah? Sarah just broke off the- Oh my god. I cannot believe this is happening. Jim Whipsy. Oh my god, look, she's gonna do it. Confess attraction? <gasps> Hold on, what is that? What is this? Wasted calories from health nut, health food nut lifestyle. All these foods are just empty calories. They provide nothing but sadness. Wow. I can't believe this is happening. <laughs> I think that you should shout forbidden words at Jamie. Who's woohooing? Who is that? Why is Teddy here? Bro, this is insane. This is getting crazy. She's going in the bed to cry. Oh, wow. I want to know who this is. Wrap it up. Oh, okay, I don't know them. <sighs> Did you give Sarah the gift? Yes, okay. Oh my god. Cut it off with toxic eggs. Generous surprise. Flirty engaged partner, scorned lover, breakup blues, slight discontent. Oh my goodness, she's gonna go yell at Stacy still. I'm keeping her in the family because I I wanna see how far they're gonna take this. I feel like Ren would like fight her. Rile up. Like Ren witnessed all of this happen. 
top of oh. Oh. oh, a decent Lenorla. Ben Kira Duka. Oh, oh my <laughs> Yeah, to boo. Uh, Oh, that scared me. Oh, if anything, Eloise and Edison need to, to stay together. I'm gonna get her to join the household real quick. And Ren, I need you to I need you to do something to her. All right, Eloise, let's get you in here. Wow, they have a lot of money. But I'll leave it. I won't touch it. No need for me to take it anyways. Eloise likes deception. Okay. Mock outfit. Whoa. I Ren, I need you to like I need you to do something bad to her. Drain life spirits? Draining a sim's life spirit grants a lot of thirst, but will wipe the sim's memory. What the? Oh my god, they're flirting again! Hold on a second, I need to look look this up. Dang. Greatly restores thirst and wipes all relationships with the target sim. That would actually be kind of funny. So we would wipe her memory and then remove her from the house. I'm wondering if I should do that or if I should, or if I should have Stacy and Jamie get together and have Evangeline break up with him and uh, raise, raise their daughter as a single mom. Man, I really wish I could get your guys' opinion right now because this is kind of important. I don't think Evangeline deserves this. I really don't. Like my gut is like, I want her to be happy and I, I want the child to have a dad, but I also, I also don't want her to be with him. He's such a sleaze. I don't know what, I don't know what it is with these two, but they were just like gravitated toward, towards each other. Oh my God. Yeah. Tell her Ren. She's like, why are you, I can't believe you would do this on her birthday of all days. Throw drain. Like, can we be for real right now? Oh, poor Sarah. Gosh, this is so horrible. I feel so bad. Yeah, I think that, uh... Ah, I'm so mad because Jamie was, like, so perfect for her. But I think what we're gonna do is have them get together. I wish we could move people back into the house, but with Legacy... <laughs> no, Sarah, no. Uh, once you move someone out, you can't move them back in. So... I was gonna like bring Evangeline back into the house so she could have her baby with everybody. But I don't know if we can do that. Well, they're gonna go woohoo in a leaf pile. Um. I'ma just let them. I'ma let them. I don't know what else I. If you guys wanna be like that. Fine. You you both deserve each other, honestly. I'm I'm so disappointed. I am so disappointed. If we move someone out, we can't move them back in, right? Gross. I hate them. Okay, you may not move or merge in other sims into the legacy family with the exception sims that will aid in bringing in the next generation. You may have non-heir family members leave the legacy family but once they are gone they may not move back in okay well that answers that question we can't bring evangeline back poor sarah she <laughs> swear she has had such bad luck with romance and it sucks because she has such a high romance skill and she is like this cute little love bug she's like a hopeless romantic I can't help but feel so bad for her. But, okay, well, let's, um, let's move Stacy out. Is there anything in your inventory that you're, no, okay. I'm gonna move Stacy into Jamie's house. I'm gonna move Evangeline out because Evangeline moved in with him. So I feel like Jamie would kick her out, make her find somewhere else to live, you know? 
which is so messed up. It is so messed up, but yeah. That's just what I assume would happen. So Stacy, you're going in there and take your freaking $30,000 with you. Evangeline. I'll figure something out for you, babes. I feel so bad. Create new household. We should give her some money at least. Okay. And we'll move her to... I want to move her into a nice house where she can raise the baby. Let's do this one. This house right here is called Family Vibe. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms. Okay. That is, um... That's not, that's not what I wanted to happen. That is not how I thought things would pan out. But here we are. We'll see how Sarah is feeling. We'll look at her moodlets in a minute and uh, see if she <laughs> is ready to go back out there. Cause we did have another option, Brianna. Um, a lot of you guys liked her in the comments. She is loyal as well, so that might help with the cheating. I don't have anything in my game right now that makes my Sims like overly romantic with each other. I don't know if you guys have this issue in your game too. If you do, let me know if that's just how the Sims is now. Um, but my game has notoriously always been just spicy. Um, my sims love to flirt <laughs> they love to have babies with other people they love the infidelity yeah i don't know i don't know man okay sarah and how are you doing what you got you have flirty engaged partner sarah's engaged partner was flirting with another sim what's been going on behind her back and then break up blues from breaking up okay i know that ren has a bunch of jewelry in her inventory that help uh, Sims get over breakups faster, so we can give her one of those when she gets back. Sarah's about to go chat online, which is fine. Oh, man. Let's see what it says in her profile now. It's very complicated. Broken engagement. Furious about cheating. Toxic ex. Furious betrayed by cheating stacy is saddened stacy wishes wishes things were different she wouldn't know bitter about breakup deeply wounded furious crazy um i'm gonna send brianna a text what's eloise up to she's just going bopping around the lot cleaning up <laughs> they're so cute I want to get them some rocking chairs. So maybe instead of that bench, we can do... Let's see. <clears throat> There's a couple from Nifty Knitting. There's a couple from Horse Ranch. We should probably do the Horse Ranch ones. Reminisce. What? What is that? What does that look like? That sounds so wholesome. Let's see. Aww. It's like the toddlers. <laughs> Their little imagination thing. Stop it. That's so cute. Adorable. So freaking cute. What's going on out here, huh? Who's this? Stella Darden. Stella Darden is everywhere, I feel. Also, Dolly, why are you all the way? over here out, out of the lot, bothering people. Look, they're reminiscing together. What a beautiful day. Uh-oh, she's pissed. Ren, I need you to come back. I need to get that jewelry from you. <laughs> no, don't kick the trash can. Don't kick the trash can. Don't, you don't need to be doing that. Tech guru career? No thanks. Okay, she got over it really fast. I believe in me from confidence gain. The most important person believes in Sarah herself. Clean air, home sweet home. Um, she's just a little bit tired. Man, she really got over that fast. Oh, Sarah didn't even give her dad his birthday gift yet. Okay, let me do that really quick. Um, give gift, bro gift. Oh my God, not the bro gifts. Okay, where is it? 
Mm, and who dad loves Sarah? That one, yes. Happy birthday, dad! Do you love it? I love it, thank you! Kelly, Shimizu, and Kaden Lundy. Evangeline had her baby. Okay. We should probably go... Go visit her. Teddy? I guess we could chat, yeah. I wonder if uh, space travel is like is tough on the on an elder sim you know what i mean oh man i bet he would love to to woohoo with eloise in the rocket ship he would 100 percent love that also why is the ranch hand not taking care of my little balls of biohazard over here what the heck what am i paying you for ren has been given a raise what about my next promotion I'm so confused. I'm gonna have to fact check that. <laughs> um, but I'm so sorry. I'm gonna have to end this episode early today, guys. I have to go and get car insurance. I know, I know. It's so exciting. I love doing stuff like this. It's, it's my favorite. Ah, <laughs> oh, I just can't believe it. I can't believe all of this happened today. Um, Sarah is, she's fine. She's not feeling any, any negative moodlets. I'm sure she's just relieved that it happened sooner than later. It happened before they got married. I also think that her traits help. Um, so she has, where's that one? Carefree. She has laid back. She has um, untroubled. Untroubled Sims always bounce back. Being a drama llama can leave relationships rocky. Nothing says carefree like moving on and letting go. So you guys saw her, her moodlets about the breakup went over and like disappeared in a few hours. So also she's a love bug. Sims with this trait are constantly swept up in the whirlwind of, of romance. They fall in love easily, often wearing their hearts on their sleeves. So I do think that she would just, you know, pursue someone else. So yeah, we can hang out with Brianna a little bit in the next episode. And it was between them two. So maybe we should just move Brianna in. <laughs> um, and yeah, Eloise is with us now. Her and Edison will, you know, um, live out the rest of their day. What the? Kieran, why are you in his bed? Oh, poor guy. He's sad. Ren, you should probably come and cheer him up. <laughs> It's your son after all. But anyways, yes, cute little uh, elderly couple living out their days. Yeah, Stacy and Jamie live together now. We're gonna have to convince Angeline, Evangeline to leave him, like actually leave him in the game. It, she's already left him in the story. Um, she moved out, but it needs to be like official. Oh my God, Ren and Evangeline have bad compatibility. Anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed, even though it was actually really, really sad today. Um, I was super excited for the wedding and I really did like Stacy, but it is what it is. Things happen. My Sims have a mind of their own. As always, leave me comments. Let me know what you think and I will see you guys in the next one. Love you so much. Bye.